Hello guys, uh, today I will be showing you how to create an Autodata account. By creating this account, you will have an access to several DAX uh, and also to the several tools and services by EOSDIS, which is the Earth Observing System Data and Information System. DAX are the distributed active archive centers from where you can download several scientific data from several different sources okay uh, let's see how you, we can create a profile uh, or an account to uh, log into this odd data and download the required data okay mm. now first of all you have to register for an odd data login profile for this you have to visit this page, this urs.audata.nasa.gov. In this page, you can find a button called Register for a Profile. Okay, uh, but uh, after clicking this button, you are you are directed to this uh, user creation or registration page, where you have to enter your profile information, uh, like a username. Okay, I'll be creating this username and I have to enter the passwords. And while you are uh, providing the passwords and usernames, you have to follow certain sets of rules uh, which are uh, spread over here in this shaded region to your right. Okay. Okay. Then you have to use uh, enter your user information. Uh, these are your first name, your middle name, your last name. Okay. And your email address, the country you belong to, and your affiliations uh, for what you are working as a tribe. I'm choosing public. Uh, nice and I'm working for a server department and study area for this you can choose any one of this uh, that is relevant for you uh, for you or you can choose others you can tick or untick this uh, two check boxes according to your uh, priority uh, but it won't affect uh, uh, your registration okay and finally you have to confirm that you're not a robot okay now after confirming that you're not a robot click this register button after applying for the registration you will get an email uh, which is an automatically generated email from usgis like this here you should be able to find a link for verifying your email address and uh, after clicking on, on that link, you will be uh, directed to this page. Okay, uh, this is not a problem. I've already uh, made an account, so this link is an old link, so it's showing like this. But don't worry, uh, the link that you get uh, that, that you get in your email will direct you to the same page like this and here you shall be entering your user credentials like this and you uh, will be able to log in to your auditor account okay you can save it or not according to your priority okay this is your uh, profile this has got everything that you entered and you can also edit your information in this page and save it uh, you can also change the passwords and there are a lot other steps uh, you can do with your auditor account okay uh, that's all for creating an audit account and logging into it. Hope you enjoy this video.
I hope that you enjoyed the video and the video was informative for you. Thank you and see you next time.